Alrighty, folks, welcome back to Let's Play Red Dead Redemption on the Mysterious JT. Last time, we rescued a uh, little person from freedom. <laughs> and now, we are trying to get a brand new... Ho oh, you know what? Probably probably bad things are going to happen if I... Uh, he's just not going to let me by and... Uh, My uh, other horse there, which is following, is probably going to get in all sorts of trouble. Say what you want about the people around here. They're friendly. Mm. You know, mm. it's one of those days. Oh, yeah. Mm. Say what you want about the people around here. They're friendly. Well, what was it that you were going to say? Jeez, people are just jerks in this game. Apparently I'm studying a Tennessee Walker rather than paying any man to this. Hey! Look! You two are making your own fun! Oh, I didn't get to intervene. Anyone else won't try taking my drink? Oh, you look thirsty. Bunch of Marys in this town. <laughs> Guys, just—he just wants to beat people up. Somebody's had a few. All right, well I'll saddle this horse, and then I guess I'll check that mail that the game is insisting on reminding me of, and because that could move the plot. Did I just run over a bird or some? Yeah, I did. All right. Picked up a rock pigeon and put it in my pocket. I guess you wouldn't really, uh. I guess a pigeon would fit in your pocket now that I think about it. So some of these side quests, like collecting ingredients for Fancy Dan and collecting dinosaur bones, I mean, I might have to wait real late or just pull out a fact to do it because. Short of running out of other content, I'm, um, I'm just not going to be in a big hurry to... T oh, is that a horse dying? Or is that horse frolicking? Not a horse guy. Damn! You ever let this horse feed? Hey, I was got space for you if you need stabling. Yeah, we're stable. And then we're gonna ride out on my lovely horse to upgrade. Oh, equipment. <laughs> I thought we were gonna like power up our horse somehow. All right, so I stabled the Appaloosa, and now I'm riding my lovely horse to Electric Boogaloo, and I'm uh, going to actually pick up this mail. At least I thought it was, but now it ain't marked on the map no more. Is there no post office in this zone? Yeah, there is. There's an actual hotel with a fence, you know, to stop people from wandering in uh, at the wrong entrance. Is that a Dalmatian? Am I losing my, my... Oh, that is a bird. No, that's an Australian Shepherd. Hello, boy. My uh, niece wants a Dalmatian, apparently. So we'll see what happens with that. <laughs> Tune in for regular updates on whether my niece eventually gets a Dalmatian. I 
don't know exactly how regular the updates will be. <laughs> This looks like a real fine hotel. You have unopened mail or parcels. Yep. Hey there. Is that Cactus Jack? I've had better days, that's for sure. Didn't ask. Didn't ask, partner. Let's receive mail. Letter from Charles Chopinet. Oh yeah, he's our friend. We helped him out with some troubles that he had. I didn't know. I didn't mean to put it away. Ah oh, crap! Ah, how do I get it back? Um. That's my journal. Fella I took to talking with at the train station told me I'd get decent money if I collected complete sets of car cards. That's if you're looking for a good bath, we got one. Get away from Get away from me. Get away from me. Horn, piss, mud, and blood I was trying to flip it over before I read it, but uh this dog is really helping me with my reading. Mon cher ami. I, you know what? We will get away from this freaking dog. You okay, boy? okay, we'll get the dog to shut the fuck up. Give it to tiny appetite dogs and maybe they'll shut the fuck up. Yeah, that's all you're getting. Give you a pat down to get you to stop barking so I can read. Okay, that apparently uh, is not sufficient. Hey, looks like I can do some crafting at this table. Perhaps I can build some uh, cannons for our settlement. Alright, dull background barking I'll just have to deal with. Mon cher ami, I made it. I have the sun on my face, sand between my toes, and a beautiful vahin in my bed. The islands are everything I thought they would be, and more. You would not believe the light and the colors and the people here. So much brighter and more alive than anything or anyone in saint -Denis. It feels like a world away, which of course it is. It may surprise you, but you are the only true friend from those days. Dreary days. My only friend. The way I see it. You did not ask for anything. You only gave. How perfect, how rare. I detest selfish asses more than civilization itself. But what is civilization really but organized selfishness? I must constrain my most primal and vital desires so you may be comfortable. Pa, no merci. The island paradise is what the civilized world would call primitive, but the people here are the most generous in ways I may not put into words, I admit. Why is this? Because they are free. I have never painted like I paint now. It is the work of... It is the likes of which has never been seen before. Never been seen. Before I sent this, I... Well, how do I actually advance this letter? What the hell? That's not the end of the letter! Okay, I was like... I was playing with all different... I don't know why. I thought I had tried the right trigger already, but... I, paint. I have never painted like I paint now. It is the it is work the likes of which has never been seen. Before I sent this, I shipped some compasses to New York to be sold. Perhaps if you own that little scribble, it may be worth something now. Either that or laugh at my ineptitude. Always yours, CC. So probably now I will... I don't even know how you go about selling shit in this game, but it might be possible to sell the item I already have from him in my satchel. I got like a doodle as a reward. This will be like this stocks in Grand Theft Auto 5 where now if I wait for a certain amount of time it will become valuable and we'll make tons of money. Uh, but beyond that our issue now is that we got a long road to Tipperary. We're pretty far away from 
the um, one of the uh, season's most innovative new sh innovative new chefs Dutch. Um, that being said, I don't see uh, any place nearby where we could hop on a stagecoach. So it might be that just getting there as fast as we can is all we can really do. Is well, that was always it. But whether getting there as fast as we can might not mean a... Um, see, I bet you anything there's tr loots or something in that lighthouse that I'm not going to bother to investigate now. But um feels like there's almost certainly something going on. What the hell am I talking about? Probably it's just as fast for us to ride as fast as we can to this place as to ride somewhere else and try to take a stagecoach. That's what I've been trying to spit out for the last minute and a half. That house over there looked like it would be a storyline robbery or perhaps one of those robbery tips missions that you can do. I've been encountering a lot fewer of those like prison wagons than I seem to be getting early in the game. Where I kept accidentally not getting to oops. Not really getting to talk to the um Let's do some high speed horse brushing. Um, I wanted a horse brush here. Idiot. Oh, sir, just in time. Oh, you're a good man. A good man. Oh, this guy's trying to steal my horse. You can kind of tell by the way he was running. You can kind of tell by the way he was running that he was going to throw me off the horse. Maybe I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's what was about to happen there. So I haven't gotten one of those prison wagon encounters in a long time where I accidentally pull a gun on the prisoner at the end and piss, you know, scare them off, but um, I had previously gotten random encounters where I just got thrown off my horse. Is this a posse? This really has the feel of a posse somehow. Howdy. Morning, Morning. Morning. Oh, good. You managed to steal someone else's horse. I'm assuming that's you. Hey, you there. Hold up. You in difficulty? You know, can't even be bothered with this. <laughs> I guess you can only rob people. I was like saying, hold up, because then I was going to say, hey there, mister. Yep. I just want to slow you down so I can ride faster than you. Now, as the armies of uh, Jin, march upon uh, the lands of Shu. We have to take the Plankwood Pass. Keep an eye out for tigers. This is going to take me straight through Saint Denis. No, I'm kind of diverting around. Good. Riding at speed through Saint Denis is pretty much a certain way of getting yourself arrested. Hi there, mister. Hey, partner. Hey there. Big intersection there. I should really get a traffic light. I got pretty good rapport going with this horse now that I can ride it this fast or this this long at speed. But it is a DLC horse, and I've been riding it for a long time. Hey there, Mister. Morning. You suppose that now I must be feeding it an off-screen action because the frequency with which I feed it on screen is not really going to keep this horse alive. Keep this horse alive. Keep this horse alive. I would love to get back to camp in time, or, or have some kind of interesting stranger interaction on the way, because otherwise, this is not a video that's setting the world on fire, I'm afraid. The uh, two biggest complaints I remember hearing about this game uh, fairly early in its release, 
the no, you know, because overall I think this game was reviewed very positively. Not surprising for a Rockstar game. And not surprising considering that uh, the thing that the gaming media is most known for is being, you know, a bunch of bullshit. <laughs> or if you score a 9.2, that means you did below average, but paid really highly for your reviews. But uh, no, the, the two big complaints coming out of fans were um, control scheme was really convoluted. And, um... Hey, mister. That's one nice-looking horse you got there. Uh, oh. How about we see how fast it is? Will you please stop? What? First one of Catfish Jackson's. Oh, why not? Ready? Let's go. Okay, well, I don't know where Catfish Jackson's is, but, um... Well, no, the complaints were the controls are convoluted and that, um... And then the other big complaint was usually that uh, there was huge amounts of really slow-paced, dull travel between uh, story objectives. Yeah. Now she's taking me past where I want to go, but it's a fairly straightforward path. Like, not a lot of weird twists and turns. As long as I don't get killed by those crazy, like, Civil War guys, I'm, uh, doing alright. That was interesting. Don't think, uh... You're expected to hit deer that way, or to kill deer that way in this game. Although I suppose in real life, you hit a deer with your car, that's a thing. Man, I'm leaving her in the dust right now. I don't know if this game has rubber banding on racing, but, uh... Or if I'm about to exhaust my horse. Oh, shit. I didn't realize this was kept... Why would I be surprised? Well, she's got a leprechaun hat on. Are you gonna shoot it? Like that one jerk? So I got nothing for that. Okay. Although I actually won... I actually won fairly handily. The racing in this game... Um, that is as uh, dominating a performance as I've had in one of these races. Not that I won by more than a couple of seconds, but usually uh, I win, but not by a ton. Yeah. I wonder if I can actually find that uh, animal I ran over, if it'll still be... Yeah, I believe it was up that path. I'm not going to bother to go find it. After all, I got a bird spoiling in my pocket. Hey there. Misters? Possibly missuses? I'm trying to figure out why the hell somebody was standing out there holding the gun, but I guess I'm actually close enough to camp now that it makes sense. Feels like I'm taking an awfully convoluted route to get in there. Oh, we got... Yeah, we got, uh... Sentries farther and farther away from camp now that we've had, uh... Well, because our location is known to our enemies. I don't know why we're still here. This might be the next mission we're about to do, is to, to relocate. I guess we're short on supplies. Now we got hundreds of dollars. 
but nobody else will take it upon themselves to spend any of it. Hey, fellas. Ah, hello, Mr. Morgan. Hello. All right. Hello, Arthur. You awake? You want to sit, Mr. Morgan? You really need to start helping out around here. I know, I know. Lucky Dutch has a soft spot for you, Arthur. Is that you? I ran into a couple of Indians in San Denis. A chief called Rangefall and his son. Johnny Longbone. I know the name. I real need a help right now. But um, so I figured I'd tell you because you're obligated to help him. Nice place you brought us to, my brother. Yes. To Lovely, isn't but it? we gotta leave because. You're a funny one, Charles. Okay, I'll catch you later then. All right. Well, I should get back to it. Okay then. Yep. Okay, I think I was talking to Javier and thought I was talking to Charles at one point and all that, but um, whatever. I'm trying to figure out what that black spec is. Oh. Uh, well. I'm tr working on it, you jerk. All right, let's uh, save in case um, I don't know. Just have them saved in a little bit. We, you know, we didn't save after we won that all-important race with random um, African American lady uh, horse rider. So, let's stop and talk to Karen before I go. No, Susan, excuse me. You okay, Miss Grimshaw? Oh, oh Driscoll's, Pinkertons. Is there anybody who doesn't know where we are at this point? Possibly the Mafia. I don't know what to tell you. Anyway, I won't disturb you. We'll see you later. Hi there, mister. Oh, wait a second. Hold on. There's like a little robbery mission here. Oh, it might be inside the house as well. Yeah, we can do a mission with Lenny. I like Lenny. Let's go rob a coach with Lenny. Put off the main story for a little bit longer. You never know. Like, if this mission does involve us relocating the camp, and I do, uh, I might lose the chance to do this particular mission with Lenny. What are you doing? Nothing. I don't believe you. You're a lying robbery, son of a bitch. Right? Nothing serious. Good. What are you robbing? A stage. I'm going to rob it of his finest actors. There's a stage coming through. According to the fella I met, it'll have a bunch of money aboard and no security whatsoever as it comes up the river trail between here and Catfish Jackson. Oh, I was just there and winning okay. a race. That sounds worth investigating. You and, uh, who? Who's army? I don't know. I, I thought I'd do it on my own. It'll be unprotected. Won't be a huge take, but I should make out okay. There ain't no such thing as unprotected. You gotta yeah. double bag it. Who you wanna go with? I guess you. Now? I guess I so. You just no initiated the mission. Oh, come on, kid. <laughs> but if we decide to do it once we've had it, look, I'm taking half the money. I thought half of it had to go to the gang. Oh. All right. Let's get going, then. That's what you get for right telling me about your activities. What well, a minute ago we were buddies. Now you don't care about my future plans. Seems like only yesterday you and me was shooting our way in here to rob those fools. Yeah. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'll be glad to leave this place behind if I'm honest. Got a bad feel to it. What? The former you slave plantation? You. Why would that bother you? Of course, I'm outside with the junior. Oh, you ain't even 20 years old. Your time will come. What? There's no way you die before the store is over. I actually don't. I don't know that every character has to die, but. It's a sound lead. I told you. And what did he have to gain by giving you this information? You mean, did I give him money or a gun? You're just gonna have to trust me on this one, Arthur. Okay. Okay, I do. You've more than proved yourself the past six months. Certainly more than that 
poor kid who got killed by the O'Driscolls. For three years. It ain't like I'm new to any of this. No. Those fellas who killed your pa? They were good folks. And I do it again right now. Of course. Yeah, I missed a bit of dialogue. I don't know what he was saying about the fellas who killed his pa. But presumably they were one of the first groups that we murdered as a gang. I mean, you can scroll back and see it. I, I will not know. Unless I go back and watch this after the video is done. But I'm more concentrating right now on just robbing this here wagon. Or fixing it. We will fix their wagon, as it were. I'm trying not to crowd you, but like I'm also using the auto ride feature um, to an extent. Lenny, why didn't you run over any of those woodland creatures? Aren't you trying to work on your um, your various challenges? <laughs> Lenny, have you had any luck collecting dinosaur bones? Well, I don't think we're finishing this in this video, but I mean, hey. Okay, here we are. I about to say, if we could get to the side of the robbery and I could call it a video, that would suit pretty well. And that seems like pretty much exactly what's happening. So, when we come back next time, folks, we are going to rob a stagecoach. Um, unless we don't. Um, we'll see where the plot takes it. I'm Serious JG. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time. Bye-bye.